missed it and we're back in output gaps. So as a change of pace, we're going to do inflationary gap first instead of recessionary gaps. And you know that the long run options are natural CFP and CMP. So in the natural option, you know that factor prices increase and the uh, aggregate supply moves uh, left from AS1 to AS2. And let's just reflect this in our graph, AS1 to AS2. And what else happens? Price increases, market demand increases, or money demand increases, uh, interest rates increases, price of bonds will fall when the interest rate decrease. When price of bonds are cheap, then people would want to have those bonds, so there's capital inflow. The domestic bonds are cheap, so we want the domestic bonds, so capital inflow. When there's capital inflow, then uh, the exchange rates get stronger because everybody wants our domestic money. And what else happens? Uh, well, the factor supply, factor supply moves right. Factor supply moves right. from S1 to S2 this is because uh, this is because people are selling are selling their foreign currency right so then in the market what's happening is there's an uh, there's a increase in supply of foreign currency because people don't want it now I'm gonna make a little twist to this and uh, let's say I'm going to try to keep E at the same level. So let's say this is E1, and let's say this is E2. So the twist is that I'm going to try to keep the exchange rate at E1 by doing some manipulations concerning the bank. So if E is flexible, if E is flexible, then, uh, yeah, I just showed you that uh, E fell from e1 to e2 now to keep to keep uh, e at e1 at e1 uh, you can pause this video and guess how and fi try to figure out how do I keep at e how do you keep at e1 but uh, right now I'm gonna just do it so how we're gonna keep at e1 is we're gonna do we're gonna make the bank do everything the opposite of the market. So when the market sells their foreign currency, the bank will buy the current foreign currency. So then the bank buys, the bank does whatever the market uh, wants. So when the market needs foreign currency, it will sell them the the, uh, the bank's foreign currency. When the when the when the market doesn't want uh, the, their foreign currency, the bank will buy their foreign currency from them. So the bank in this case buys foreign currency buys foreign currency because because the market they don't want their foreign currency the bonds are cheap so they want the domestic currency so then so then the bank will buy the foreign buy the foreign currency for them and by buying the foreign currency they'll increase their uh, demand they'll increase their demand from d1 to d2 from d1 to d2 and that's how we keep the exchange rate the same okay now we're on cfp that took a while but yeah cfp so we know that in cfp government spending decreases or tax increases ad uh, moves left from 81 to 82 so let's just reflect this in our graph so 81 let me check yeah 81 i'm just checking if i did the natural right and yes i did so 81 to 82 81 to 82 I'm really tired and I'm, I'm afraid I might do something wrong out of exhaustion so price goes down money demand also goes down uh, interest rate goes down uh, when interest rate goes down the price of bonds will go up when price bonds go up that means our own bonds are expensive, so we want to buy the foreign bonds. So there's a capital outflow. There's a capital outflow. So then the foreign currency uh, demand is right, moves right, moves right. Foreign currency demand goes right. 
from f from d1 to d2 not f d1 to d2 so let's just reflect this in this graph so it moves from d1 to d2 and this was our first e1 and this is e2 so what what is happening here is that um, the market demands foreign currency so demand demand FC so they demand FC okay now uh, now if if E is flexible if E is flexible then I just showed you that E increased from E1 to E2 so I just showed you that in this graph here now to keep E at E1 to keep E at E1 uh, what do we have to do or what does a bank have to do well the bank will sell their foreign currency why is that dog moving away the bank sells uh, foreign currency so pretty much what will happen here is um, the supply will go right and so so the, the bank sells foreign currency so so yeah there is an increase in supply of foreign currency in the market just because the bank starts selling their foreign currency so yeah to keep e at e1 the bank sells their foreign currency and we get back to e1 because the bank sells their foreign currency now there's a huge amount of foreign currency there's a huge supply of foreign currency in the market now the uh, now the contractionary monetary policy is where uh, ms goes down or the interest rate goes up and 80 moves left from 81 to 82 so that's essentially this graph here and in addition to that what else happens well price goes down money demand goes down interest rate goes down and I'm not going to do the bank and reaction because it's pretty much the same thing as what we did in the past video. So I'm just going to go ahead and go do the overall effect of CMP. And pretty much the overall effect is what follows. Uh, interest rate goes up because it follows CMP because the bank follows CMP, remember? So interest rate goes up and the price of the bonds go down price of bond goes down and then there's a capital inflow because the price of bonds are cheap we want uh, we want our own domestic bonds so there's a capital inflow so now we're in the same situation as the natural situation where um, there's a capital inflow and the exchange rate uh, appreciates uh, um, foreign currency supply moves right because everybody's uh, the market is selling their foreign currency so then the bank will buy that foreign currency to keep the exchange rate at E1 and so I'm just gonna write here to save you some time that it's the same situation same situation as the natural long run option as natural LR for long run option so that's all I want to go through for today. Next video, of course, we're going to have to do a uh, recessionary gap. And yeah, please rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.